The future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their cars. Very much so with this new BMW. Behold this beauty in flamenco red. Presence. And power. And look how big the kidney girls are. To keep your engines cool, huh? Mm-hmm. This front section has been sculptured to be more formidable. An athletic silhouette. I like how elegantly the roof line declines. And I like the 21-inch wheels. These taillights, see how slender they are, Dennis? Equipped with the latest LED technology. Okay. Switched off, the smoked glass lends a cool subtlety. Switched on, and you get BMW's signature L shape. I have a hunch he really likes it. Do you think? That's about its entirety. What a stance. Ah. Look how the panorama roof aligns the interior of a coupe with the spacious feeling of an SUV. And with the X4, you get all the M model stuff. You know, you've got the sporty steering wheel, the sporty seat that you're enjoying at the moment. Is that a Sensatec dashboard? Okay, good spot, Dennis. Thanks, Nikki. And here's the 10 inch center display, freely programmable. And you can use the display via touch, gesture, or voice. So nice. Don't forget about the iDrive touch controller. Very mm. nice. For more exciting information, click here. Forget his video. If you want to come for a drive with me, watch my video. Forget about the other films. Clinic has so much more interesting. Click here. Or you could also just watch the design film Driving. again. So what have we got here? A straight six-cylinder petrol engine with a not-too-shabby 360 horsepower and naught to 60 miles per hour in 4.8 seconds, plus a weight distribution of 50-50. Hey, Nikki, can you hear us? Hey, guys. How's it going? Yeah, I am loving this. I mean, the car literally sticks to the road and you can really feel the ground underneath you as well. And that's thanks to the hard M suspension. But don't worry, guys. There is comfort mode for you. Nice and soft, just as you like it. Uh -huh. Thanks, Nikki. Uh -huh. That's cute. She's thinking of us. Hey, Nikki, are you using the steering and lane control assistant? No, what's that? Well, it just supports the driver in monotonous traffic situations. And it speeds all the way up to 210 kilometers per hour. That's perfect for you, Nikki. How does it work? Check this out. This is the car. Well, obvi. The important thing is, the car uses both a multiple area surveillance radar system as well as a stereo camera. So on the road, it uses the road markings to orient and position itself and automatically keeps the desired distance from the vehicle ahead. It's almost like having your own co-pilot, right? Kind of. Okay, so what do I have to do? Just press the button and you'll see the green icon. Ah. How's it going, Nikki? Who would have thought that boring could actually be so exciting? Hey, Nikki. Nikki? Nikki? I knew you'd like the driving. You want to see more of that? Watch the main film over here. Or you could watch the design film here. No, don't do that. The most exciting film is definitely Connected Plus. Click here. Why would you click on any of those when you can click on Design? Or watch Driving again.
Rise of the Fury. Three, two, one. Fighters in the heat. Don't get that belt that can't keep the speed. He turns up the street. Bring up the old 